report out about a new computer virus that may be aimed at destroying a bricks and mortar facility. Now, as a computer, a new virus is not only infecting your computer, but the crooks behind it are also extorting money. All the most dangerous computer virus in a decade. Searching for information on the latest installment in the Twilight series could get your computer infected. No one likes computer problems, so if Microsoft calls or sends you an email saying they've detected a problem with your PC, what should you do? The obvious answer, fix it, is wrong. Cyber attackers have launched a virus that can destroy your computer files. The virus is called Stuxnet. It's called the FBI virus. It's called the Crypto Locker Virus 2.0. So you saw the click, you saw the title of this video, and it says that Macs are just safer, MacBook Pros are the safest computer. I have a couple of reasons why, but I really just have one main reason as to why, and it's this great new feature that they just released with iOS 13 and macOS Catalina. So let's get right into it. Over the years, people have argued Windows or macOS, macOS or Windows, sorry, Linux. I mean, yeah, Linux is there, but the argument is macOS or Windows, because Linux people are like, Linux is just better than everything. And I'm not gonna argue with Linux people because, you know, so. <laughs> And while each has its own place in the world, macOS for people that don't really want to tinker, just sort of have it locked down, just buy one thing and that's it. And Windows is sort of the other way around where it's not locked down, it's super customizable. You can build your computer and then put Windows onto it. So I think a lot of people typically lean towards Windows because it has more advantages for most people. And while it might have more benefits for most people like businesses and just your average, like I want to check YouTube and check my email and basic stuff like that, I think that Macs are still safer. And the main reason is from this new app called Find My. Find My is a new app replacing Find My iPhone in macOS Catalina and in iOS 13. And as Apple states, locate a missing device even if it's not connected to Wi-Fi or cellular using crowdsource location. When you mark your device as missing and another Apple user's device is nearby, it can detect your device's Bluetooth signal and report its location to you. It's completely anonymous and encrypted end to end so everyone's privacy is protected. This is an awesome feature. This keeps not necessarily the documents safe, but the physical product, the MacBook Pro or the MacBook Air, even the iMac, it'll keep that physical product, it'll keep that product safe. And it's really, really cool. I think that most people haven't really been talking about this new feature, but this is the type of feature that sort of changes the game in my opinion. Something that you don't really realize is there, but then once you need it, you find it, and then it's like, oh my gosh, thank God I have this feature. Apple devices just work really well together. So basically to explain a little bit further, what Apple's saying is, if you lose your MacBook Pro, let's say, and you mark the device as missing, and there's an iPhone nearby, it'll ping the iPhone from that MacBook Pro saying, hey, I'm here, and then the iPhone can shoot that data up, encrypt it end to end, send it to Apple, who will then encrypt it again and send it to you. So that way each user is safe. The user who sends it doesn't know who they're sending it to, and the user who gets it doesn't know who it was sent from. So it's really cool. I think it's actually, it's so smart, and I think not a lot of criminals are going to know that people that would steal a product, which is what this is I think primarily for, or if you were to leave it somewhere, primarily for somebody who steals a product, if they have an iPhone, they could unintentionally be the person who tells you where your device is, or if they have an iPad, or if they have a MacBook connected to Wi-Fi, they could actually be the one who tells you where it's at. There are obviously other reasons why Macs are safer, but it's sort of this weird paradigm because the reason that Macs are safer and Linux computers are safer than Windows is not because the operating system is just safer and it's just way better and everyone should use a Mac. That's not the reason. The reason is the sheer number. The number of viruses, according to recent research from Dr. Nick Peeling and Dr. Julian Satchel, there are about 60,000 known viruses for Windows, 40 or so for the Mac. Basically what those numbers mean is that there are just far more viruses available for Windows than they are available for Macs and Linux users. But a lot of what viruses are, it's not necessarily, oh, because you have a Windows computer, you're going to get a virus. It's more of 
Well, if you're a Windows user and you don't really know what you're doing and you're told to download something and you just download it, then you start running .exe files and then you start getting viruses because you allowed somebody access to your computer or you downloaded something that allowed people to access your computer or some form and version of that, which is to say that no computer is the safest, but with Macs not being nearly as widely spread as say any desktop like a Dell E5410, you're going to have way more people trying to attack those computers because businesses are built on Windows. They're not built on Mac OS, they're built on Windows. So saying that Mac OS and Linux are safer is technically true, but my reasoning wasn't because of viruses, it was mainly because of Find My. Your device is literally safer in the hands of Apple. Now some people might complain about this, but from my experience, I trust Apple, maybe more than I should, but I do. And I think that it's really good that they're offering this new Find My app on Apple devices, iPhones, iPad, Mac devices, Apple Watch, whatever, you name it. It's really exciting to see that. And I think that's gonna keep a lot of people's devices safer and less likely to be stolen because typically, at least in my opinion, people are more willing to steal a MacBook as opposed to like a Dell XPS. While Dell XPS looks nice, they know a MacBook has value. That Dell laptop, they don't know what it is, but a MacBook, it has value. They see the glowing Apple logo, they see the non-glowing Apple logo, and they know that if they steal that, it has a value. So download Find My, use it to your advantage if you have two Apple devices. It only works if you have a second Apple device, which is annoying, but it's Apple. So thank you guys for watching the video. If you liked it, hit subscribe, hit that like button, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.